what's up gamers welcome back to another video it's me again built the tower still figuring out what i'm going to title this video but anyways i wanted to tell you guys that i've been having so much fun recently you see currently um um i've been stimulating my mind a lot well kind of because like you see just a few minutes ago i was i was um doing three things at once and I think that that was a really cool source of, of me doing stuff. And a good so source of entertainment. You see, the three things I was doing. First off, I was listening. You, you guys can kind of see this. I can't move my camera. But um, I, I was listening to some Black Girl Brides on my CD player. Well, actually, I still am. It's just that I turned the volume down. Um, so that I don't get copyright strike for making this video. Um... Another thing that I'm doing, still doing it right now, I'm playing Animal Crossing. I've been playing Animal Crossing so much, this is literally like the, the, it's, it's the most fun I've ever had. Speaking of Animal Crossing, um, what's it called? I paid off my loan, my, my massive one million dollar, over one million dollar home loan. And you see what happened was like last night I was, it was like, like, an hour before Nook's cranny shut, and um, I thought to myself, "Hey, I still have like one hundred and ten thousand bells, and yet I cannot go to sleep like this." And then I also thought to myself, "If I pay off my home loan within one hour, then I get to wake up tomorrow or today, and I have a really cool basement." And so that's what I did. I spent the entire hour. Right before I went to sleep, just grinding away at Animal Crossing, getting 110,000 bells. And I paid off my home loan, and now I have a basement. Was it worth it? Probably. I mean, I got a cool stamp as well, and I got like a thousand, or did I get a thousand or two thousand or something? I forgot how many Nook Miles I got. But I did get some Nook Miles from that, which is pretty cool. And you see... I'm gonna share with you guys some tips on, um, what's it called, getting a hell of money in Animal Crossing. So, what you wanna do is, you, Nook Miles, they are very important, well, kind of important, because you see, something I've, uh, I've calculated, for every Nook Miles point you get, you can, it's, it's worth six bells, um, and... If, if, if you get 500 miles, then you can trade them in for bell vouchers and get 3,000 bells with a bell voucher if you sell it. And that's pretty cool. Um, and then you can just sell those and get a lot of money. And you see, getting nook miles, it's actually really easy. Because, I mean, some of the things you can, like, do to get them, it's either, like, really hard or really easy. Like, especially with, you know how there's the ones at the top when you go into your Nook, Nook phone and go into the Nook Miles app? And there's, like, those things at the top and you can complete them. Like, and then they, like, re... You know, that, that, that's, that's an amazing way to get Nook Miles. And then trade them in for bell vouchers and then get bells and then pay off your home loans. Another thing you can do, just strip your island of all materials. Or most materials. Like, like fruits, especially foreign fruits, and um, what's it called? Like, s seashells. Well, seashells do respawn, and also a great way is like fish and bugs, just selling those, and sea creatures. Um, what else? Oh yeah, today it's also, it's also, um, a Friday the 26th of June today. July. Why do I keep confusing that? I don't know, they both start with J. Anyways, um, so yeah, today it was Friday, that, that was very cool, the last day of school for the week. Um, it went by surprisingly fast, which is actually pretty cool. Oh yeah, um, also, funny story from today. So, you see, what's it called? I had another interaction with my English teacher, Mr. Ladder. Um, I mean, I see him, like, multiple times every day, so it's not surprising that I had another interaction with him. But anyways, so you see, we were in the library and we had to choose a book to get, to get out, to issue. 
Um, I didn't actually issue any books, but I was looking at some books, and I found this book of, about witchcraft, and I was reading it, right? And I was reading the book about witchcraft. Um, and then Mr. Ladder, he came up to me, and he was just like, Oh, Tal, what are you reading? I closed the book to show him the cover, and it was a book about witchcraft. He said that that was very cool. And he asked to see the inside of the book. So I flicked it open to a random page, and he looked down and uh, he looked down at the page and chuckled. So you see, I looked down to see what the what the what he chuckled at on the page, and it turns out that the random page that I had flicked to had a massive hitting of how to arouse passionate love in a man. Like why did I have to flick to that page out of all pages in the book? Like Jesus Christ, the book was like that that thick. Why that page? But what is? Oh yeah, also speaking of um, Mr. Ladder, and what's it called? I wrote out a cookie recipe, and I I gave it to him. It was like it was an A4 piece of paper. I spent the entire morning working on writing it out since like I didn't really have that much time to do it. But I wrote it out, and I drew a really, really cool picture of a plate of uh, the cookies, and then I gave it to him. And I hope that he likes the cookies. The cookie recipe. Also, by the way, his favorite color is, he likes blue and green. I overheard him telling one of my classmates that. Um, what else? Oh yeah, that's right, I don't think I finished telling you guys the three things that I was multitasking so this, like, a few minutes ago. So you see, of course, I'm playing Animal Crossing, listening to Black Veil Brides' Rich and Divine on my CD player, but I was also watching The Good Doctor at the same time, which I think is really cool, because it's like my brain focusing on different things. Like, I have my computer screen playing The Good Doctor, and then I have, I have my Nintendo Switch to the side, and I have my CD player blaring at full volume. And it's very, very interesting. If you guys uh, find focusing hard, then I would recommend you try this to make it even harder and challenge yourself. Oh yeah, guys, I also went to the gym again today. Um, my back still hurts from doing all of those lat pulldowns. The other day. I, I did like 200 lap pull downs. My back still hurts from that. Um, anyways, yeah, it's the weekend, so I'm so totally looking forward to tomorrow. And, oh yeah, and we had spaghetti bolognese for dinner. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you get all the latest updates. Otherwise, I'm sure.